we should strive not to use violence in fighting for our cause, but by non-participation in anything you believe is evil. We are concerned not merely with the technical problem of securing and maintaining peace, but also with the important task of education and enlightenment. Without such freedom, there would have been no Shakespeare, no Goethe, no Newton, no Faraday, no Pasteur, and no Lisa. Science has provided the possibility of liberation for human beings from hard labor. When the ideals of humanity are war and conquest, those tools become as dangerous as a razor in the hands of a child of three. We must not condemn man's inventiveness and patient conquest of the forces of nature because they are being used wrongly. The fate of humanity is entirely dependent upon its moral development.